Jackie Coogan, an actor who captured audiences' hearts as a child star, was born on October 26, 1914. His career spanned over six decades, and he left an indelible mark on the film industry. Coogan began his acting journey at the tender age of five, appearing in the 1921 film My Boy. He quickly gained popularity and became a household name thanks to his role as Charlie Chaplin's sidekick in The Kid. As Coogan grew older, he transitioned from silent films to talkies, showcasing his versatility as an actor. He starred in various films, including Tom Sawyer, The Buster Keaton Story, and The Parent Trap. Coogan's talent extended beyond films, as he also made appearances on television shows such as The Addams Family, where he played Uncle Fester. Coogan's career was not without challenges. In 1935, he sued his mother and stepfather for misappropriation of his earnings, leading to the passage of the California Child Actors Bill, also known as the Coogan Act. This law aimed to protect child actors' earnings and ensure their financial security. Despite the ups and downs of his career, Jackie Coogan remained a beloved figure in Hollywood. His contributions to the film industry continue to resonate with audiences today, and his legacy lives on through his classic films and television shows. The actor's ability to captivate audiences and adapt to changing times remains a testament to his enduring talent. Jackie Coogan was a beloved actor, known for his work in both film and television. You might recognize him from his role as Uncle Fester in The Addams Family, or from his early career as a child star in Charlie Chaplin's The Kid. Do you have a favorite work of Jackie Coogan's? Perhaps you hold The Kid closest to your heart, or maybe you cherish his performance in The Addams Family. Out of the many legendary works that Jackie Coogan has done, which one do you believe defined his career? Was it his groundbreaking role in The Kid, or his memorable performance as Uncle Fester? We would love to hear your stories and memories related to this classic star. Do you have a particularly fond memory of watching Jackie Coogan on screen? Or maybe you had the chance to meet him in person. Whatever your experience, we want to hear from you. Share your memories and stories in the comments below. And stay tuned, because there are many funny, shocking, and sad facts coming up about Jackie Coogan. You won't want to miss it. Born on October 26, 1914, Jackie Coogan's interest in acting was sparked at a young age. His father, John Henry Coogan, was a vaudeville performer who introduced Jackie to the world of entertainment. By the age of two, Jackie was already appearing on stage with his parents in their act. The actor's natural talent for performing was evident from the start. He was soon appearing in films, and his first major role came in 1921 when he starred alongside Charlie Chaplin in The Kid. The film was a critical and commercial success, and Coogan's performance stole the show. Coogan's mother, Lillian Dolliver, also played a significant role in his upbringing and career. She recognized her son's potential and encouraged his acting pursuits. In fact, it was Lillian who negotiated Coogan's contract with Chaplin, which included a then unheard of 75,000 salary for the young actor. As Coogan's fame grew, he became a household name. He was one of the first child stars in Hollywood, and his influence extended beyond the silver screen. Coogan's impact was so significant that his name became synonymous with child actors, leading to the term Coogan Law being used to describe laws that protect child actors' earnings. Throughout his career, Coogan worked with some of the biggest names in Hollywood, including Oliver Hardy, Stan Laurel, and Buster Keaton. These collaborations further solidified Coogan's status as a talented and respected actor. In conclusion, Jackie Coogan's upbringing and early exposure to the world of entertainment played a significant role in shaping his career. With the support of his parents and the guidance of mentors like Charlie Chaplin, Coogan became one of the most beloved child actors of his time. His impact on the industry is still felt today, and his legacy continues to inspire new generations of actors. Jackie Coogan, born in 1914 in Los Angeles, was destined for a career in entertainment. His father, John Coogan, was a talented vaudeville performer, and his mother, Lillian Dolliver, had acting aspirations. From a young age, Jackie accompanied his father to the studio, where he developed a keen interest in acting. At the age of five, Jackie made his film debut in Skinner's Baby, and quickly became a child star. His breakthrough role came in Charlie Chaplin's The Kid, where he played the titular character. The film was a critical and commercial success, and Jackie's performance was widely praised. Jackie's early life experiences shaped his career in many ways. His parents encouraged his love for acting, and his father even served as his manager. However, their relationship became strained as Jackie's earnings grew. 
In 1935, Jackie's mother and stepfather were accused of misappropriating his earnings, leading to a highly publicized legal battle. Despite these challenges, Jackie continued to act, appearing in films such as The Racket and Tom Sawyer. He also transitioned to television, starring in the popular show The Addams Family as Uncle Fester. Throughout his career, Jackie remained a beloved figure in Hollywood. His early experiences in the industry, both positive and negative, shaped his career and left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. Today, he is remembered as a trailblazer for child actors and a talented performer in his own right. Jackie Coogan's passion for acting was ignited at a young age. Born in 1914, he was barely a toddler when he first appeared on stage, accompanied by his parents who were vaudeville performers. His natural talent and charisma were quickly noticed, and he began to steal the spotlight from his parents. By the time he was five, Coogan had already become a seasoned performer, captivating audiences with his comedic timing and expressive face. One pivotal experience that fueled Coogan's desire to pursue acting as a career was his appearance in the 1921 film The Kid. Directed by and starring Charlie Chaplin, the film told the story of a tramp who finds and cares for an abandoned child. Coogan played the role of the child, and his performance was nothing short of remarkable. He held his own against the legendary Chaplin, matching his comedic prowess and bringing a warmth and vulnerability to the character that resonated with audiences. The kid was a massive success, and Coogan became an overnight sensation. He was hailed as a child prodigy and a natural talent, and his career skyrocketed. He went on to appear in numerous films and shows, becoming one of the most popular child actors of his time. Despite his success, Coogan never lost his passion for acting. He continued to work in the industry for decades, appearing in classics such as The Racket, The Buster Keaton Story, and The Parent Trap. His contributions to the world of film and television are still celebrated today, and his legacy continues to inspire new generations of actors. Throughout his career, Coogan remained humble and dedicated to his craft. He once said, I never wanted to be a star, I just wanted to be a working actor. This simple yet powerful statement speaks to Coogan's love for acting and his commitment to his art. For him, acting was not just a job or a means to an end. It was a passion, a calling, and a way of life. The actor Jackie Coogan considered his 1972 reunion with Charles Chaplin a significant moment in his career. After two decades of exile, Chaplin returned to the United States to receive the Handel Medallion and a special Lifetime Achievement Oscar. At Los Angeles International Airport, Coogan, who hadn't seen Chaplin in decades, warmly embraced him, saying, you know, I think I would rather see you than anybody else. Chaplin later praised Coogan's talent, telling his wife, you must never forget that your husband is a genius. Coogan's career included notable roles in both film and television. In the classic television show The Addams Family, Coogan originally auditioned for the role of Uncle Fester, but was rejected. Determined to land the part, he shaved his head, did his own makeup and costume, which won him the role. Later, in the classic television show The Partridge Family, Coogan took over the role of Grandpa Renfrew during the final season. Initially, the roles of Shirley's parents were played by Ray Bolger and Rosemary Daycamp, but Coogan's portrayal of Grandpa Renfrew, whose name was changed to Walter, added a new dynamic to the show. In summary, Jackie Coogan's career included notable roles in both film and television. His determination and talent were evident in his portrayal of Uncle Fester in The Addams Family, and Grandpa Renfrew in The Partridge Family. His reunion with Chaplin in 1972 was a significant moment in his career as Chaplin recognized and praised his talent. Jackie Coogan, a child actor in the early 1920s, faced numerous obstacles on his rise to stardom. Born in 1914, he started his career at only 18 months old. Financial struggles were a constant challenge for Coogan and his family. To make ends meet, they relied on his income from acting. Despite his early success, the film industry was skeptical of such a young actor's abilities. Coogan, however, proved them wrong with his natural talent and dedication. He became one of the most popular child stars of the era, known for his role in the classic film The Kid with Charlie Chaplin. Coogan's mother, who managed his career, was not always financially responsible. This led to the loss of much of his earnings. In response, Coogan advocated for the Coogan Act in 1939 which requires a portion of a child actor's earnings to be set aside in a trust for their future use. The actor's resilience in overcoming these challenges is a testament to his determination and passion for his craft. His legacy lives on, not only in his iconic roles, but also in the protections he helped establish for child actors.
Jackie Coogan, a child actor famous for his role in the 1922 film Oliver Twist, faced an unfortunate incident when producer Saul Lesser admitted to burning the original master of the film for its silver nitrate content, which was worth 80. Despite this setback, Coogan's career was marked with success early on, earning him a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame at 1654 Vine Saint. However, as the actor grew older, his career began to wane after his early sound versions of Tom Sawyer and Huckleberry Finn. The Hollywood community quipped that senility hit him at 13, highlighting the harsh realities of the industry's treatment of child stars. Despite the challenges he faced, Coogan's contributions to the film industry as a child actor remained significant. His work in Oliver Twist left an indelible mark on audiences and solidified his place in Hollywood history. Jackie Coogan's career as a child actor was marked by several breakthrough moments. In 1921, he starred in the film The Kid, directed by Charlie Chaplin. This classic movie showcased Coogan's remarkable acting skills and established him as a prominent figure in the film industry at the tender age of seven. The film not only gained critical acclaim, but also became a commercial success, earning over two million at the box office. The actor's performance in The Kid was groundbreaking as he held his own against the legendary Charlie Chaplin. Coogan's ability to convey complex emotions through his facial expressions and body language left a lasting impact on audiences and critics alike. Chaplin himself praised Coogan's performance, stating that the actor was a natural and one of the most interesting children I have ever met. Coogan's success in The Kid led to a series of successful films, including Oliver Twist in 1922 and Peck's Bad Boy in 1923. His performances in these films further solidified his status as a talented actor and cemented his place in Hollywood history. However, Coogan's career was not without its challenges. In 1935, he starred in The Whole Town's Talking, a film that marked his transition from child actor to adult roles. Although the film received mixed reviews, it was a significant turning point in Coogan's career as it demonstrated his versatility as an actor. Coogan's impact on the film industry was not limited to his acting skills alone. In 1938, he became embroiled in a legal battle with his parents over his earnings as a child actor. The case resulted in the passage of the California Child Actors Bill, also known as the Coogan Act which required that a portion of a child actor's earnings be set aside in a trust for their future use. In conclusion, Jackie Coogan's career as a child actor was marked by several breakthrough moments, including his groundbreaking performance in The Kid and his successful transition to adult roles in films like The Whole Town's Talking. His impact on the film industry extends beyond his acting skills, as he played a significant role in the passage of the Coogan Act, which has protected the earnings of child actors for generations. In November 1920, a life-threatening accident left a significant impact on six-year-old Jackie Coogan. While riding in a car, it crashed into a tree, resulting in a severe basal fracture of his skull. Although the other passengers sustained only minor injuries, Coogan's condition was critical. Fortunately, he received proper medical care and was released from the hospital after a few days. Jackie Coogan's career skyrocketed during the 1920s, surpassing even the popularity of Rudolph Valentino and Douglas Fairbanks. As reported by the New York Times, his stardom was undeniable, making him a beloved figure in the film industry. Despite his initial success, Coogan's relationship with his mother and stepfather deteriorated following a lawsuit over his earnings. Although they eventually reconciled, the bond was never fully restored. Coogan's advice to future child stars reflected his experiences urging them to stay away from mothers. This classic tale of a child star's rise and challenges serves as a reminder of the complexities that often accompany early fame. Jackie Coogan's story resonates with many, leaving a lasting impact on the world of film and entertainment. Jackie Coogan, known as one of the first child stars in Hollywood, had a unique approach to acting that set him apart from his peers. As a young actor, he was often directed to portray overly saccharine or overly precocious characters, but Coogan brought a naturalness and authenticity to his roles that made him a beloved figure in early American cinema. Coogan's ability to convincingly portray complex emotions was evident even in his earliest roles. In the 1921 film The Kid, directed by Charlie Chaplin, Coogan played a young boy who was abandoned by his mother and taken in by Chaplin's tramp character. Despite his young age, Coogan was able to convey the character's sadness, fear, and anger with a depth and nuance that belied his years. This emotional intelligence was a hallmark of Coogan's acting style and can be traced back to his personal experiences. 
Growing up in a show business family, Coogan was exposed to the world of acting from a young age. He began performing in vaudeville shows with his parents at the age of two, and quickly developed a love for the stage. However, Coogan's childhood was not without its challenges. His father's death when he was just nine years old left Coogan and his mother in a precarious financial situation. Despite this, Coogan continued to work in film and became one of the most popular child actors of his time. These early experiences shaped Coogan's worldview and informed his approach to acting. He brought a sense of grit and determination to his roles, reflecting the struggles he faced in his own life. At the same time, he maintained a sense of innocence and wonder, capturing the spirit of childhood in a way that few other actors could. Coogan's unique style and approach to acting have left a lasting impact on the film industry. His ability to convincingly portray complex emotions, combined with his naturalness and authenticity, have made him a beloved figure in classic cinema. Even today, his performances continue to resonate with audiences, serving as a testament to the power of artistic vision and the enduring appeal of a true Hollywood legend. After an impressive career spanning several decades, the actor Jackie Coogan retired from acting in 1980, following the filming of The Escape Artist. His last released film, The Fury, had been filmed the previous year. Coogan's passion for acting began at a young age, and he quickly became a household name, known for his memorable roles in silent films such as The Kid alongside Charlie Chaplin. Duke Kahanamaku, an Olympic medalist, played a significant role in Coogan's life, serving as his swimming instructor. This classic film industry icon not only excelled in acting, but also had a knack for swimming, showcasing his versatile talents both on and off screen. Beyond his own accomplishments, Jackie Coogan's impact on the film industry has extended to future generations. He is the grandfather of actor Keith Coogan, who has followed in his grandfather's footsteps, pursuing a career in acting and carrying on the family's thespian legacy. Coogan's contributions to the world of film continue to resonate today, inspiring new generations of actors and film enthusiasts alike. Jackie Coogan's impact and influence on the film industry are significant, particularly for his role in the 1921 classic The Kid. As a child actor, he became one of the first stars of the silent film era, paving the way for future generations. His natural charm and comedic timing captivated audiences, making him a household name. Coogan's influence extended beyond his acting abilities. His collaboration with Charlie Chaplin and the kids showcased the power of storytelling through visuals, setting a precedent for future filmmakers. The film's emotional depth and exploration of social issues resonated with audiences, making it a timeless classic. Industry experts and those inspired by Coogan highlight his contributions. Film historian Kevin Brownlow notes, Coogan was a natural performer, his acting instinctive and spontaneous. This spontaneity and authenticity were groundbreaking for the time and continue to inspire actors today. Moreover, Coogan's influence transcended the film industry. His career sparked conversations about child labor laws and the treatment of child actors, leading to the enactment of the California Child Actors Bill, also known as the Coogan Act. This legislation aimed to protect child performers' earnings and ensure their financial security. In addition, Coogan's impact on storytelling is evident in the way he approached his roles. He brought depth and nuance to his characters, challenging the stereotypes of child actors. His ability to convey complex emotions through physical comedy and facial expressions left a lasting impact on the industry. In conclusion, Jackie Coogan's contribution to the film industry is immeasurable. His influence on trends, techniques, and storytelling continues to resonate today, inspiring future generations of actors and filmmakers. Jackie Coogan, a well-known actor, enlisted in the Army in March 1941. After the attack on Pearl Harbor, he decided to become a glider pilot due to his civilian flying experience. After completing glider school, he was made a flight officer and volunteered for hazardous duty with the 1st Air Commando Group. In December 1943, his unit was sent to India, where he flew British troops and landed them at night 100 miles behind enemy lines in Burma on March 5, 1944. In addition to his military service, Coogan faced demonstrations during a visit to Vienna in October 1924. Some people on the far right believed he was Jewish, but he was actually of Irish Catholic descent. Furthermore, Coogan has a connection to actor Don Stroud. Coogan was once Stroud's stepfather, adding another layer to Coogan's personal life. Overall, Jackie Coogan's life and career were marked by his military service, the misconceptions about his heritage, and his personal connections in the acting world. 
Jackie Coogan, known for his role in Charlie Chaplin's The Kid, had a personal life filled with passion and values that extended beyond the silver screen. As a young actor, Coogan's philanthropic efforts were already taking shape. In 1935, at the age of 22, he established the Jackie Coogan Polio Foundation, aiming to combat the polio epidemic that was sweeping the nation during that time. Coogan's dedication to helping others was inspired by his own experiences. Having been a child star, he had earned a significant amount of money, but when he reached adulthood, he discovered that most of his earnings had been squandered by his mother and stepfather. This unfortunate incident led Coogan to advocate for child actors' rights, leading to the passage of the California Child Actors Bill, also known as the Coogan Act, in 1939. This law required that a portion of a child actor's earnings be set aside in a trust for their future use. Apart from his philanthropic endeavors, Coogan had a deep interest in automobiles and racing. He was an accomplished race car driver and even competed in the Indianapolis 500 in 1937. Coogan's love for cars was also reflected in his work, as he appeared in several films featuring automobiles, such as The Big Race and The Human Comedy. Coogan's personal values, such as compassion and fairness, were evident in his philanthropic efforts and his advocacy for child actors' rights. His life outside of acting was a testament to his belief in giving back to the community and ensuring that young artists were protected and treated fairly in the entertainment industry. Jackie Coogan's health suffered significantly due to his long-term habits of chain smoking and heavy drinking. Despite these challenges, his name lived on in the 1992 film adaptation of The Addams Family, where a hardware shop was named Coogan's in his honor. Born to vaudeville performers Jack Coogan Sr. and Lillian Coogan, Coogan made his stage debut at the tender age of 16 months as part of his parents' act. His natural talent was evident even then, setting the stage for a successful career in the entertainment industry. Jackie Coogan, a child actor who became a household name in the 1920s, left an indelible mark on the film industry. His role in Charlie Chaplin's The Kid propelled him to stardom and paved the way for future generations of young actors. Coogan's legacy lies in his ability to bring authenticity and emotion to his performances, even at a young age. Today, the film industry has evolved significantly, but the core principles of acting remain the same. Coogan's advice for aspiring actors would likely be to stay true to oneself and to always strive for authenticity in one's performances. In an industry that often values flashiness and spectacle, Coogan's emphasis on authenticity serves as a reminder that at the heart of every great performance is a deep understanding of the character and their motivations. Moreover, Coogan's career also highlights the importance of adaptability in the entertainment industry. As a child actor, Coogan had to navigate the challenges of growing up in the public eye, and later in his career, he successfully transitioned to adult roles. His ability to adapt to new challenges and opportunities is a valuable lesson for aspiring professionals in any field. In terms of future contributions, the film industry can continue to honor Coogan's legacy by prioritizing authenticity and adaptability in their work. By creating complex and nuanced characters, filmmakers can inspire young actors to push the boundaries of their craft and to approach their work with a deep sense of purpose and authenticity. In conclusion, Jackie Coogan's legacy within the film industry is one of authenticity, adaptability, and enduring talent. His advice for aspiring actors is to stay true to oneself and to embrace new challenges and opportunities. By prioritizing these values, the film industry can continue to create captivating and impactful work that resonates with audiences for generations to come. Jackie Coogan, a child star of the 1920s, achieved remarkable success at a young age. Estimates vary, but it's believed he earned between $4 million and $8 million during his eight-year run of stardom. His contract with Metro earned him an impressive $1 million per year. However, Coogan's personal life was marred by money problems with his parents. This experience led him to advocate for the protection of child actors' earnings. He played a significant role in getting the Coogan Bill passed, a law that safeguards child actors from financial exploitation. Beyond his professional accomplishments, Coogan was also a devoted older brother to Robert Coogan. Despite the challenges he faced, Coogan left an indelible mark on the film industry, transforming the way child actors were treated and protected. Jackie Coogan's journey in the entertainment industry was nothing short of remarkable. At the tender age of five months, his acting career took off, and by seven, he became a global sensation with the kid. His innovative talent led him to work alongside Charlie Chaplin, 
leaving an indelible mark on silent films. Despite the decline of silent films, Coogan adapted to sound movies, showcasing his versatility. However, his most significant contribution came in 1935 when he fought for the Coogan Act, protecting child actors' earnings. This legislation, still in place today, underscores his enduring impact on the industry. Coogan's career spanned over six decades, from silent films to television, including his iconic role as Uncle Fester in The Addams Family. His passion for acting and perseverance through challenges serve as a powerful reminder of creativity's potential. In the end, Jackie Coogan's life and career resonate with the power of creativity and determination. His legacy continues to inspire and remind us that with passion and perseverance, one can leave an enduring impact on the world. Jackie Coogan, uncle of Jonathan Coogan, was a child star in the early days of Hollywood. His parents, both vaudeville performers, introduced him to the stage at just 16 months old. Coogan's breakout role came in 1921, when he starred alongside Charlie Chaplin in the film The Kid. As a result of his early fame, Coogan amassed a significant fortune. However, when he reached adulthood, he discovered that his parents had squandered his earnings. In desperate need of financial assistance, Coogan turned to Chaplin, who gave him 1,000 without hesitation. This act of kindness inspired Coogan to advocate for the rights of child actors. In 1939, he successfully lobbied for the passage of the California Child Actors Bill, also known as the Coogan Act. This law requires that a portion of a child actor's earnings be set aside in a trust, ensuring that they have financial security when they reach adulthood. Despite his financial struggles, Coogan continued to act throughout his life. He appeared in numerous films and television shows, including The Racket and The Addams Family. Through his advocacy and his acting, Coogan left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. In the 1921 film The Kid, Jackie Coogan, who would later become known as Uncle Fester in the 1960s sitcom The Addams Family, played the adorable kid. At this time, Coogan's on-screen chemistry with Sir Charles Chaplin was already evident. Chaplin, who also directed the film, took Coogan to amusement parks and pony rides every Sunday during the initial weeks of filming. Some viewed this as Chaplin's attempt to reclaim his own unhappy childhood, while others saw it as Chaplin recasting Coogan into the child he had just lost, long before his role as Mr. A in the 1958 film High School Confidential. Confidential! Coogan had already been leading a musical ensemble in the 1930s. In this film, Coogan, dapper in pinstripes, can be seen playing the piano while the beat poetess recites her lines. This classic role showcases a more mature and sophisticated side of Coogan, far removed from his earlier days as the adorable kid. Despite the significant gap between the kid and high school confidential, Coogan's talent and versatility as an actor remain consistent. His ability to adapt to different roles and genres is a testament to his enduring impact on the film industry, which continues to resonate with audiences today. The actor's contributions to this classic film and his earlier work with Chaplin remain an intriguing part of Hollywood history. After gaining fame as the child in the 1921 film The Kid, Jackie Coogan became a symbol for the protection of child actors' rights. His parents and stepfather had squandered his earnings, leading to the creation of the Coogan Bill. This legislation ensured that child actors' funds would be safeguarded for their future, preventing the mismanagement of their earnings by parents or guardians. Coogan's career continued to flourish, and he reunited with Sir Charles Chaplin, who had discovered him in 1972. This encounter took place during Chaplin's brief return to America for an Honorary Academy Award. The reunion marked a significant moment in Hollywood history, as two legends of the silent film era came together once more. In addition to his film career, Coogan served in the U.S. Army during World War II. In March 1944, he was stationed in the China-Burma-India Theater, where he piloted a CG-4A Waco, a wood and canvas transport glider. His military service demonstrated his commitment to his country, further solidifying his status as a respected figure in American culture. Jackie Coogan, a well-known actor, had a role in the 1930s radio show Forever Earnest. Unfortunately, the show was canceled. Coogan also participated in an interview for the book Talking to the Piano Player Silent Film Stars, Writers and Directors, Remember by Stuart Ehrman. In addition to his acting career, Coogan was also connected to a notorious event in history. He was a college friend of Brooke Hart, a kidnapping and murder victim. Reports indicate that Coogan took part in the lynching of Hart's killers. This dark chapter in Coogan's life is a stark contrast to his successful career in entertainment. 
1921, the world was introduced to a talented child actor, Jackie Coogan, in the film The Kid, directed by Charlie Chaplin. Coogan's career took off after Chaplin saw him in a vaudeville performance with his father, Jack Coogan Sr. The elder Coogan took a break from his career to coach his son, who was paid $125 a week, while Jack Sr. received $75 a week for his efforts. The film's production was lengthy, causing First National Pictures, the company contracting Coogan, to complain. Chaplin resolved the issue by inviting executives and theater exhibitors to the studio for a tour and meet and greet with the cast, including Coogan. The visitors were so impressed that they agreed to be patient, and their patience paid off when the film became a major success. By the mid-1930s, Coogan had grown up and led a 17-piece orchestra on a tour of one-night stands, claiming to have earned $12,000 a week. Coogan's career as a child actor and the kid had a significant impact on the film industry and his own life, leading to a successful music career in his later years. In 1935, Jackie Coogan's personal life took a turn for the worse. He was engaged to the stunning actress Toby Wing, but their relationship was fraught with difficulties. When asked for autographs during this time, Coogan would often write inscriptions backward to impress Wing, which only served to confuse the autograph seekers. Unfortunately, their relationship ended due to differences in temperament, adding to what was already a challenging year for Coogan. He had lost his father and was dealing with his mother's refusal to pay out his childhood earnings, making 1935 a year he would likely rather forget. Despite his critically acclaimed performances in The Kid and Oliver Twist, Coogan was often miscast in many of the other films he starred in as a child actor. His talent was undeniable, but he didn't always fit the roles he was given. In 1937, Coogan found himself in legal trouble when performer Thia Foster and Lila Lee were injured in an automobile accident while on tour with a big band that Coogan was conducting. Lee and Lillian Tours, who were also on the show, spoke on Foster's behalf during the trial. The California State Industrial Accident Board eventually found that Consolidated Radio Artists, the company responsible for the show, was liable for the accident. Coogan, who was also an employee of Consolidated, was not found to be at full attendant in summary, Jackie Coogan's career and personal life were filled with ups and downs. From his early success as a child actor to his legal troubles later in life, Coogan's story is a testament to the challenges that even the most talented individuals can face. Jackie Coogan, an actor known for his role as the original Little Rascal, left an indelible mark on early Hollywood. His work in the 1921 film The Kid, directed by Charlie Chaplin, showcased his remarkable talent and established him as a prominent figure in the industry. Coogan's ability to bring joy and laughter to audiences was truly special. His charisma and comedic timing were on full display in the popular Our Gang series, which captured the hearts of many. As we celebrate this classic actor's work, we would love to hear your thoughts on Jackie Coogan's legacy. What are your favorite memories of his performances? How did his work influence your love for entertainment? Feel free to share your stories and opinions in the comments below. Your engagement and participation help create a vibrant community for all of us to enjoy. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content celebrating the creative spirits that have shaped entertainment. Together, let's cherish and appreciate the enduring impact of Jackie Coogan and other legendary artists.